What's up, my grub lovers? I'm ready to get that grub on. You know that I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. Uh, today, we're going to have a little quick breakfast run. You know, we're always doing the fast food, uh, you know, judging by service, uh, you know, wait time, presentation, things like that. Uh, so, we're, we should try with breakfast too, right? It's only fair. So, um, I'm going to hit the Dunkin' Donuts this morning and we're going to try a little quick run, uh, quick breakfast, you know, put them to the test, man, and, uh, you know, see what we can actually find out about their quality and their presentation, guys. All right, so we're going to head over there right now and put them to the test, and I'll see you guys in a bit. It's your boy, Mr. Grubb. Um, yes, can I have a, a bacon, egg, and cheese bacon bagel? What kind of bagel? Uh, the original is fine. Plain. Okay. Uh, can I, and can I get a dozen mixed donuts? Okay. Um, a large iced coffee vanilla. Yes, please. Okay. And a, um, let me get a small frozen coffee, chocolate. You want mocha? Yeah, mocha, sorry. Okay, anything else? Um, that'll be all. All right, so I have four rounds. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, guys, so as you saw, we just placed our order. Um, you ever get somewhere and don't know what you want? So a lot of times you guys will see me uh, doing things and one thing I hate to do is uh, be selfish, I guess you could say. So what I mean by that is uh, when it comes down to a lot, especially, <clears throat> especially when uh, you're dealing with fast food, when it comes down to service, uh, I try to think about the employee a lot of times only because I work in a business where, you know, uh, like most people where it, it's all about the only way to make money is to make sure that the customer is taken care of, right? So uh, at the same token, customers know that, you get what I'm saying? So a lot of customers... Uh, go in with the thought like I'm gonna go in and they're gonna give me what I want because they know they don't have a choice and that's not fair you know what I mean I don't think it's fair so uh, I always try to go in thinking about the employee so by doing so I try not to especially in a fast food situation I try not to uh, drag out you know my order like oh uh, yeah one moment please and then they wait there and they're waiting they're waiting and then it's like oh you ready yet oh give me a few more minutes you know that's that uh, that's not fair because at the end of the day even though even if we don't always know what we want uh you know we have an idea because we know where we're going you get what i'm saying so to drag it out drag it out drag it out drag it out sometimes especially not understanding in certain fast food environments uh they have timers you know it's, it's certain you know pvas they have to meet uh in regards to all right look it takes us an average of 38 seconds to get a customer's order. It takes us an average of three minutes to fulfill that order. That could be good. They may have a goal of two minutes, you know what I mean? But at the same token, I'm over here costing you 12 minutes because I don't know what I want because I'm indecisive and that, that's not fair. So that's just sometimes why if you guys see me order, I may order like a, a whole lot of <laughs> food. Uh, just because, man, you know what I mean? Uh, I, I, I just think, I, I really do think it's unfair. So I try to be 
you know, more so understanding, and that's the reason why I do what I do. But anyway, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get the food, and I'm gonna let you guys know how it is. It's your boy, Mr. Grub. So, finally got my food. Wait time wasn't bad at all, actually. Um, and they're super packed. It's, you know, it's early in the morning, uh, so everybody's trying to get breakfast right now. Uh, I'm glad I was able to get mine in a decent amount of time, so uh, that I wouldn't be late for work. So, like I said, I got the uh, the breakfast bagel, uh, as well as for me the uh, frozen mocha. And it's a little chilly outside, but I, I don't know why I can't just drink straight coffee, man. I don't know anybody else like that. It's it's just it's just I don't know. I don't know what it is, man. It goes down smoother for me, uh, frozen. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got, and then we're gonna dive right in, guys. Check it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and dive in so I can get my day started. Oh man, and it's hot too. Wish you guys can see the steam off of it. So I got the bacon, egg, and cheese bagel. I got that because it's been it's it's been a while, but the last time I had this, I got it from McDonald's, right? And they had their bacon, egg, and cheese bagel. Um, so I was like, well, at least I know I have something to compare it to. Dunkin' Donuts is actually better. Um, the bagel isn't hard. The egg is fresh, and the bacon is crispy. So shout out to Dunkin' Donuts for that. Mm. That's good. It's not greasy. You know what I'm saying? I like that. Not to mention, I'm still not sure what the sauce is to be on McDonald's uh, bacon, egg, and cheese bagels. But every time you bite it, it's leaking out the bottom. I don't even know what it is. Uh, so it's good to be able to eat it and not worry about it all over your clothes and stuff like that. So shout out to Dunkin' Donuts for that. Um, like I said, based on presentation, um, you know, the quality, the taste, as well as the service. Um, I give him a 10 on the bagel, man. I mean, it's a bagel, but like I said, they did their thing, man. You know, I don't really go heavy like that on fast food a lot, but they did their thing on that, man. So, uh, go ahead and try my frozen drink. You know, y'all bear with me because I can tell you I am with coffee, but like I said, I'm pretty good with frozen, so I'm going to try it, and, and, and hopefully theirs is uh, it's good or better than what I previously had, so. Oh, yeah. That's it right there. So I got mocha um, because I'm a chocolate fan. I love chocolate. So even if it isn't as good as I would like it to be, I can withstand it enough to finish it because I like chocolate, you know what I mean? But it's actually uh, surprisingly good, man, really good. So, um, you know, all in all, like I said, they, they they get a 10 from me, man. They did a great job uh, just with the breakfast alone. So, and it's quick and it's something I can just take on the go. So that's what I'm looking for. Something to just keep me going. Nothing that's going to have me sluggish. Um, and that was perfect. So shout out to Dunkin' Donuts for that, man. You guys did your thing. I'm going to go ahead and finish my food up, and I'll get back with you guys in a bit. It's your boy, Mr. Grub. All right, guys, so uh, I am definitely ready for today. That was a great start to my morning. The iced coffee definitely helped set the tone for me, man. So uh, today should be a wonderful day. I can't wait to get my day started and uh, get more content for you guys. So uh, until next time, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's your boy, Mr. Grub.